Hey there, art lovers! Today, we're diving into the world of Peter Paul Rubens, a brilliant artist who lived way back in the 17th century. Let's talk about his life experiences and how they influenced some of his most famous works of art. Rubens was born in Siegen, Germany, but spent most of his life in Antwerp, Belgium. He was a pretty studious guy and loved learning about all sorts of subjects. He even got to study under some of the best artists of his time. Can you imagine getting lessons from the greats? One of his early paintings, Epitaph of Nicolas Rocox and his wife Adriana Perez, shows his skills as a portrait artist. It's a beautiful tribute to these important people in his life. Rubens was also an expert in capturing emotions, and you can see that in his painting Descent from the Cross. The sadness and grief in their faces are so real, it's almost like you can feel it yourself. Now, Rubens liked to mix it up and explore different themes. In Judgment of Paris, he shows a mythological scene with gods and goddesses having a little dispute. It's like being in the middle of a dramatic soap opera. Then, there's the Feast of Howard, where Rubens painted a gruesome scene of King Howard ordering the beheading of Saint John the Baptist. It's not for the faint of heart. But not all of Rubens' paintings were intense. Check out his portrait of a young captain. It's a cool mix of strength and elegance, showing the power and beauty of the subject. Now, let's talk about Rubens' religious works. In Flagellation of Christ, he depicts the crucifixion of Jesus with intense passion and drama. You can practically feel the pain and suffering in every stroke. He also painted Der Heilige Sebastian, which is a religious scene of Saint Sebastian tied to a tree and shot with arrows. Rubens really knew how to capture those intense moments, didn't he? But let's not forget about his more light-hearted works. Rubens painted a lot of cute cherubs, and one of his famous ones is called Cupid. It's an adorable little angel, sitting there with his bow and arrow, ready to make people fall in love. How sweet is that? Lastly, let's mention his masterpiece, The Triumphal Chariot of Callow. This gigantic painting celebrates the grandeur of war and victory. It's like a visual explosion of colors and action. Rubens really went all out with this one. So, there you have it, folks. Peter Paul Rubens, a master of emotions and a genius painter. His life experiences and endless curiosity shape these incredible works of art that will leave you in awe. It's amazing how one person can create such a rich and diverse portfolio. Stay curious and keep exploring the world of art.